Hey guys, welcome to Kalita Vlogs, and I'm all married, so that's exciting. Yay! So, um, I had a couple requests for people to show the for, to show you guys the deck that I was using. So, um, I'm gonna run you through it really quick. So, this is a more beast heavy um, hunter deck. Some people use um, uh, a trap heavy deck instead, um, and some people use the turn eight kill. Um, I usually need to get to about turn 9, possibly turn 10 in order to win, um, and the damage definitely comes mid to late game. It's not a very early uh, attack deck, so um, if that's more your style, don't use this deck. And this deck, it's kind of been hit or miss for me. I'm not too... I don't know, but I don't really play that amazingly, as you probably have guessed by now. Anyway, so... This deck uses, uh, I should say, I found this deck, um, <clears throat> I'm trying to think now, I can't remember the website, I'll, uh, I'll put it down in the, I'll put the link to the deck down in the description below and it gives you kind of some guides on how to play it. Uh, so you need two Hunter's Marks, one Flare, uh, two Tracking, and because I've leveled high enough I've gotten the gold ones, two Unleash the Hounds, this one's pretty crucial especially for uh, when you get Snake Trap, it's really nice, uh, two Timber Wolves, two Snake Traps, Two Iron Beak Owls, two Scavenging Hyenas, two Starving Buzzards, three Animal Companions, two Animal Companions, two Kill Commands, two Iron for Grizzlies, two Multi Shots, two Hound Masters, two Savannah High Mains, and one King Crash. So we'll kind of briefly, quickly go through what what this one does. Um, the Hunter's Marks change a minion's health to one. So if you've got um, a guy with a taunt and you can't silence it off and you just kind of want to destroy it really early, use one of your really cheap guys to kill it, uh, Hunter's Mark really comes in handy. Flare is really good against any um, players that use secret, so that would be uh, Mage, Paladin, or other Hunters. Um, all minions lose stealth, so if you're playing against someone like a Rogue or some Hunters play a lot of stealth beasts, um, you can use that and you get a card out of it. So that's really nice. Tracking, it's kind of tricky. Um, you look at the top three cards of your deck, you pick one, but you have to discard the others. They don't go back into your deck. You never get to see them again. So this one sometimes can be really, really awesome. And sometimes you really, you have to choose between two really, you have to kind of like make a hard choice. Um, Unleash the Hounds. It gives your beast plus one attack and charge. So if you've played a whole bunch of beasts and you really want to buff them up, uh, this is a really good one to have. It's also really nice for um, if you use snake trap because your snakes become two one, or if you end up summoning, you end up killing off your savannah high main because you end up with uh, three two hyenas, which is pretty snazzy, and it affects all beasts on your thing. So if you have seven beasts, they're all going to get buffed. Uh, Timberwolf, all of your other beasts have plus one attack. Uh, snake trap, so it's a secret. And when one of your minions is attacked, it summons three 1-1 one, one snakes. So that's, uh, for those of you who are confused, that's one attack and one health. Um, but your minion needs to be physically attacked, either by a weapon used by the hero or by another minion. Spells do not count. Um, it only counts if the minion actually physically moves and attacks them on the board. Uh, Iron Beak Owl, it's battle cry. So as soon as you play it, you get to silence a minion. You can silence any minion you like, one of your own if it has one that you're not too crazy about, or one of the enemies. Um, scavenging Hyena, whenever a friendly beast dies, you get plus two and plus one, so you'll get an extra two attack and an extra one health. Um, Starving Buzzard, whenever you summon a beast, so you either play a card or Snake Trap happens, or in this case in this case, Snake Trap or the Death Rattle for the Savannah High Main happens, you'll get an extra card. So if they go to attack this and you have Snake Trap up, you'll get three cards before it dies, which is really, really nice. Uh, animal Companion, you can summon a random Beast Companion. You will either get uh, Loek, which buffs... Is it all minions or all beasts? I think it's all beasts. And he is 2-4. You can get uh, Heifer. No, Huffer, um, who's a boar. And he is 4-2 and he has charge. Or you can get Misha who is worth 4-4, four, four, and she has Taunt. She's a bear. Uh, kill Command deals 3 damage, but if you have a beast in play, it does 5 damage instead. Very nice for getting rid of those really annoying Taunt guys. Uh, Iron for Grizzly is a 3-drop that is 3-3 three, three and has Taunt, which is a good um, early Taunt to have mid-game. Usually gets killed off, but it saves you from taking damage pretty early on. 
Multi-shot is kind of a situational one. You deals three damage to two random enemy minions. So if they only have one minion in front of them, you cannot use this card. It will not let you. Um, so that you, this is really good for um, classes that uh, use a lot of, for decks that use a lot of minions. Um, so warlocks, this is really good against. Uh, paladins, this is usually pretty good against. Um, but, and again, every class has a deck that has a style, a play style that's very minion heavy. So it has its uses. Um, but if you see it in a tracking, for example, I usually, unless I've noticed that the player is playing very minion heavy, I usually pass this one up for something else. Uh, Houndmaster, it gives a friendly beast, 2-2 uh, two, two, and taunt. So what I really like to do with this one is combine it with the Savannah high main, so they have to attack it and you get the death rattle, which is the 2-2 two, two hyenas, which is really nice. And the Savannah high main has a death rattle, so when it dies, 2-2 uh, two, two hyena, 2 Two two hyenas come up in its place, um, which is really really handy. And again, if you have the starving buzzard up, you will get two cards uh, for each two cards for those hyenas. And then lastly, I have my legendary king crush, and it is a eight eight beast for nine mana, and it has charge. So this is a very good kind of final attack to have. Um, if you want, what you can do is you can hold. If you end up going second, you can hang on to your mana coin and um, use this. <clears throat> excuse me, uh, on turn 8 instead of turn 9, and that is really, really handy. Anyways, this is my deck. Let's see it in action. Right, level 27, I'm 3-star uh, gold, so maybe hmm, you can get me to 1-star platinum today. I doubt it, but you never know. Could happen. So hope all of you had a wonderful weekend. I got married, and it was amazing, and... I almost cried when I was walking down the aisle when my then fiance now husband was there, but I managed to hold it in. Um, it was a lot of fun. We ate at our favorite. We had our favorite. We had the reception at our favorite restaurants. So that was a blast. Ooh, warrior. This should be fun. Um, so yeah, we had the reception at our favorite restaurants. So that was a lot of fun. Um, yeah, it was all in all a really good day. Nothing got too mucked up, which was really nice. And uh, we had cupcakes for everybody. We had a little cake for us, and instead of cutting it, we just took our forks, jabbed it into the cake, and then fed it to each other. So that was a blast. Um, I will take you. Job done. And yeah, it was a really, really good day. Wait, I guess I should end my turn, huh? <laughs> Yeah, so this is the guy I was talking about. Okay, so yeah, it's, it is all minions, not just beasts have plus one attack. So that's nice. Um, I'm going to save this. I don't want to use it just yet. I will say I used to be really bad for um, using up all of my cards as soon as I could. And then I, what you do, it was called top decking, where you're just, you're dependent on the next card. You don't have a, like a reserve kind of held up. And I've gotten better at not doing that, so that's been really good. Um, what are we going to do? I'm going to do... This. This. Yeah, he, I, 
think he's the least liked of all of them. One is taunt, there is charge, the other buffs, which is great, but if you play it early on, he's pretty much guaranteed to get destroyed. Alright, well. Let's do this. Where is my I really need my snake crab. The frost wolves stand ready. Okay, yeah, you need to get silenced. Ow. Okay, that's not good. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna silence you. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Just based off of his minions, he does not have lethal next turn, so that's nice. But who knows what he has in his deck right now. Yeah. Well, that's a nice card. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Oh, huh, very cool. Oh, I love the animations on that. Something I really like about the gold cards is the animations are just really cool. We must cleanse the sun well. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Okay. We're gonna do this. Save that. We'll do that. We'll do that. Oh, alright. I guess I win. Well, that's exciting. Yay! And, and, and. No, still three star gold. Well, that's okay. That went pretty well. Oh, and I get more coins. Um, so yes, I will keep saving up coins and I will do an arena run. I'm just going to keep playing. I'm actually really enjoying this. I'm doing okay so far. So there you go, guys. I uh, hope you found that entertaining, I suppose. Um, I'll probably make the switch back to WoW on Wednesday. Um, and then Friday, I think I might start doing Fridays just maybe either me or a... Uh, some random new game just to try it out. So maybe Minecraft or Rogue Legacy or something. Anywho, like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.